Hi guys. So I have started getting kind of what I like to call a sweatsuit addiction. No big deal. Either way, the one that I'm wearing right now is actually one of my newest additions and I'm gonna set this down for you and we're gonna do kind of like a try on haul. I only have a few to show you at the moment, but I am gonna show you a few pieces that I'd like to switch and like switch and just swap out. And I have a few that I basically would just wear together. And here is the first one. I'm actually wearing it right now and I'm kind of short. So <laughs> I'm gonna try to get this like as much on camera as I can. But basically this is just a really cute sweatsuit and it's got cute high-waisted pants and this cute little zipper over here. I hope you guys can see that. But I'm gonna show you the bottom of my outfit. Peep my cute little socks over here. But it's got really cute pockets. And basically I got this from Target. I think I got this, ooh, sorry my phone's falling over. But I got this a few weeks ago from Target and I really like it. And I think it's super cute. But in case you guys are wondering, I am wearing a size small. It fits pretty true to size. I mean, it seems to fit me pretty well. But this is the first one I wanted to show you. I got this from Target, but the only drawback I would say is that even though it's super cute, it was kind of pricey. You had to buy like the tops and the bottoms separately. But I would say if you're looking to just buy yourself a few little nice things, and if some of you are getting that stimulus money, you know what I mean? Then you can afford to get yourself some stuff. And I would say definitely go for it. This is super cute. Like I said, I love the little zippers that are on this. It's just got a zipper like down at the bottom. And the pants fit super nice. I really enjoy this outfit. Like I said, they're super high-waisted. And that's nice for a short, short girl like me. So either way, I'm going to show you guys the next outfit. All right, guys, next outfit time. This one is kind of like the other one, except it's got like, let me put this down a little so I can show you guys. Hmm. Sorry, it does not want to cooperate with me. But basically this one is cute too. It's got like this little tie-dye pattern again. And as you can see, this one's also got pockets. The only drawback I would say is that it's got like these super long strings, which I have a little bit of an issue with. Oh, Pete, my Riverdale poster over there, guys. How about that? Anyways, I like this one a lot. It's super comfy and almost feels like some kind of pajama type material. But I did ask the girl in the store and she did tell me this is a jumpsuit. No, not a jumpsuit. I'm sorry. Sweatsuit. I'm a liar. It's not a jumpsuit. <laughs> but I'd say the only drawback really is these long strings over here because I'm not sure exactly what to do with them. I keep on like tucking them into my pants because I have an issue with like, see, see how smooth that looks. It, I think it's supposed to look smooth. And then when you put like the strings there and then you tie them without tucking them into your pants, you have like an issue of there being like a little bulge right there. And it's just irritating all around. But either way, I really like this outfit. I think it's super cute. The back is of the shirt is like a little bit longer than the front. And like I said, it's super cute. It's got like this little tie-dye pattern again. And I actually got this one from a store called Dry Goods. It's like a super cute boutique looking store. And I got this on sale, guys. Like you had to buy the top and bottom separately. The bottoms were 22 and the top was 10. So like basically I got this for $32 whenever normally it cost over a hundred with the tax because I figured it out. Anyways. I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys the next one now. Okay guys, third one. So this is the only other matching one that I have. And as you can see, it's just basically like a, it's a little hoodie, sweatshirt and sweatpants set. And I really like this one. I got this one when I was actually working at Pink for a while. For those of you that don't know, I did a little stint at Pink. It was a seasonal job, so. It was a lot of fun and I got like a lot of stuff for a bunch of low prices, basically. Anyways, 
this one i i think this is absolutely my favorite one although i do like the colors of this purple one i showed you guys first but if i'm going by like comfort level the amount of times i've worn it like i have slept in this before it's it's that comfy just saying either way it's all gray and once again we got like the nice pockets going on and this one's a little bit oversized so like this is an extra small I'm wearing at the moment and I would definitely say take your size and go down one because it is super big super comfy like I legit have slept in this many times and I also have a pair of black pants which I'm about to show you I don't have a top that matches the black because when I worked there we did not have like matching sets basically like this I had to track this one down and steal this hoodie off of a mannequin there you go that's what I did anyways I'm gonna show you my black pair of pants with a little sweatshirt that I really love to put it with so just give me one sec and we're gonna go right to the next one okay as promised here is my other outfit I ended up getting this cute little pink quarter zip I believe this is called a quarter zip don't come after me if you call it a half zip I'm so sorry but basically I got this cute little um hooded quarter zip when I worked there and I paired it with this other pair of pants that I was telling you guys about that I got from pink see it's got the little pink label down there and it's got super deep pockets so like you can put your phone in it you can put basically whatever you want in it I don't care either way us women as you know we like pockets so <laughs> I was a huge fan of these pants as soon as I put them on they are literally so comfortable I wear them all the time like I'm not even joking and here you go guys here's like a little little shot of me in it I just think that this little quarter zip goes super cute with these pants and I also have a black quarter zip that looks just like this in case you're wondering for size reference the one I'm wearing right now is a bit oversized and it's a medium I also have a black one that's a small and that pretty much fits me so once again, I would say either try it on or probably go down a size again. Because <laughs> I put on the medium and it's a bit big and baggy, which I like baggy. So if you're looking for more of a baggy look like I do, I would probably go for a more medium size one. Either way, I have one more I'm going to show you and then we will recap. Okay guys, so here is the last... I'm going to change this camera angle. Here's the last one that I promised you. And the shirt is black because I'm a huge fan of black. A lot of people think I'm like a huge pastel, you know, bright color person. But I actually look the best when I'm working, wearing darker colors. Since my eyes are such a dark blue, a lot of people assume that, <laughs> you know, I have darker eyes, like brown, for instance. And I'm always having to tell them no. Either way, here's the last outfit. I just kept my hair the same and I got this cursive pink print and these cute pink pajamas pajama bottoms basically but they're more of like a sweatpant and as you can see on the bottom they have the cute little cursive print that this top does and this top that I'm wearing is actually a medium so once again a bit oversized you can probably wear this with leggings too if you'd like. I put it with sweatpants because I just thought it looked cute that way. But anyways, that's all I have for you guys today. Oh, and here are my new nails. Don't know if I ever show you guys that. But either way, thank you all for watching. And let me know in the comments below if you like these types of try-on videos. I have only done, I think, one of them, which has like over 2,000 views. It's almost a 3,000, I believe. But either way, let me know if you like these in the comments. And if you're new here, make sure to like, subscribe, all that jazz, I guess. And I'll see you in my next one.